morning. It's officially our first day in San Francisco and we are off to get a boat <laughs> to Alcatraz, which if you're not familiar, you probably are. It's, uh, a, uh, it's an island that used to be a prison. Of all the days for my tummy to be sick, today was probably not the best day for it to happen. <laughs> On the boat. We actually got a little table, which is cool. So here's hoping I don't like shame myself. Coolest gift ever. Prisoner mug. That's class. So we finished the audio tour and I have to say it was good. It was definitely good. But we went to the Eastern State Penitentiary in Philadelphia last year and did something very similar and it was much better, much more thorough. And I enjoy that one a lot more. So if you are gonna go to one, I would definitely recommend the Philadelphia one over the Alcatraz one. But it's not an island, so. Oh my God, it's like freezing. I'm gonna have to go buy a pair of jeans or something. We're going back to Vegas. We're going back to Vegas. We need to go back to the heat. But how are we gonna survive in Ireland? But yeah, hold back on ground, got the boat back, and again, didn't shit myself. Bit of an outfit change, we're now in scarf, long sleeve top, pants, feeling a little bit more comfy, a little more at home too. Ian just had an epiphany. Why is your bottom called your bottom? Because it's not at the bottom of you. Mind. Ian just totally fixed my camera. I can now shake it all I want and there's no that like really annoying rattling noise. I should have enlisted you way back at the start. Sounds Lesson like I wasn't learned. even there. It's almost like I don't consult you. Yeah. Look at these things. Nifty. Look how gorgeous these houses are. I really like that one. It's absolutely immaculate. Ladies, have to ask you a question. Were you ever out in public when your bra started to really irritate you? And I don't mean your underwear, I mean the actual bra started to itch your boob. So you just whip it off and give your bra to your boyfriend's mind for the rest of the day? No? Just me? And Ian is only disgusted that he has to carry my bra around in his pocket, aren't you Ian? He's nodding. What's the big deal? It's only a piece of fabric. You hold it with them. <laughs> So we're off the bus. That was an experience. Not the best tour bus I've ever been on. What do you think, Ian? Uh, Way too long at stops. And kind of a bad driver too. So now we're trying to find Union Street for some chaperoning. Don't, don't tell Ian there's a Lululemon here. Snapchat is great and all, but I keep forgetting to vlog. So I've been to Lululemon. 
Ian is holding the bag also gracefully and popped into Lush too. And I had the most delicious, I suppose you call it lunch. I had an, what, how do you pronounce it? Acai bowl from Earth Fresh or something. I don't know. But it was nice and it was like huge. If you follow me on Snapchat, you'll have seen it. it was like the size of my head. And I made a decent goal of it and then Ian obviously finished the rest, obviously. Now we, Union Street was actually really nice, like full of boutique shops, which is where I went into Lululemon, went into Lush, but then there was a lot of like unique shops as well, which is kind of cool to see, and restaurants and bars and stuff. Now we are going back to our, sorry, just checking to see if I'm behind me. We're heading back to our tour bus. No, we're not, we're heading back to the sea. And probably get back on the tour bus there. And go somewhere else. We fucking froze on the Golden Gate Bridge. Oh my God, it was so cold. <laughs> you could actually see in the clip, Ian was literally, he wasn't doing that to cover his face. He was doing that to try and stay warm. It was freezing. So if you're planning on doing this tour, bring a coat and a scarf and a balaclava. We're going to eat somewhere a little different spuds. this evening. We're gonna get spuds. And you might think I'm joking, but I'm not. This place is called Hot Spud. And apparently it's the most expensive date you'll ever buy, but the best. Two spuds, two drinks, $28. These better be good. Take it back, this looks more like a meal than just a spud. You can see all the different things I got in there. I cannot wait to dig into this. It's probably the coldest thing I've ever experienced. What do you think, Ian? Ah. Uh, <laughs> Words of wisdom would be. Yeah! <laughs> Profound, as always. Um, it is, really. So I think we've just decided we're going to stay in San Francisco an extra night because we're actually due to go, to leave here. Okay, today, it's Friday night. We're due to leave here Sunday morning, but we've nothing booked on where to go. But we've booked Santa Barbara for Tuesday night, so, or no, for, for Monday night till we actually fly home to Ireland. The only thing we were kind of like, what are we gonna do Sunday night? Do we stop halfway between here and Santa Barbara and then on to Santa Barbara on Sunday or we just do one extra night here? I think I want to do one extra night here to get a few extra bits done that we want to get done and you may as well do a city properly if you're gonna do it. Uh, so I'm gonna go to bed now once I've warmed up. Sorry for looking so shit. Like, I just look like the room looks black behind me. Probably because it is. So, yeah. Oh my god, it's 8.47. Good night!